Hey, how's it going everyone? How you guys doing tonight, today, wherever you're from in this beautiful world? Okay, well I've got one. It is by Wander Brewing out of Bellingham, Washington. This is called She Wore a Cranberry Beret. Uh, American IPA fermented, fermented on Washington grown cr cranberries. It's a 7% ABV and I did not see any IBUs. The date on this can is 4720, so it is fairly fresh, about a month old, so not bad at all. Let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, let's do it. Had some good reviews, like in the 3, 5, 4 range. Wow, it's got a real pink color to it. It's cool. It's got little uh, cranberries with little berets on. <laughs> I hurt my finger. I have a blister on my finger. So I poured it somewhat, I guess not so rapidly. Um, ended up getting under a finger head. Uh, a pink head at that. Oh man, that tart cranberry-like smell really comes out. It's just, it's real tart smelling on the nose. Even has like a slight even raspberry or some kind of other berry notes coming out of it. But that cranberry is definitely on point. I get I even get a little like peach and stuff in this. It's weird. Malty, I'm getting some malty, some got in my nose, getting a little maltiness in there. Um, it's definitely on the side there. A little like um yeah, just like a sweet malt, a sweet bready malt. Very nice, though. It smells good and fruity. It's nice. It's hazy. Kind of murky hazy. It's hazy. Let's call it that. Got some lacing on the glass going already. It's a white, small head. Retention wasn't super great. It's kind of a um, pinked orange-like look. Uh, it somewhat resembles, I guess, what you would get out of a cranberry juice or something. A little more orange. Pink on the pour, though. Kind of a reddish pink. Let's, I uh, got some stuff floating around in there. I was going to say let's go ahead and taste it, but I wanted to look at it just a little more. It's got a slow to medium rising bubble. Let's taste this beer. Tart is the first thing I get out of it. Cranberry tart. There's even some uh, orange ra and raspberry in there. Orange. More of a tangerine. Kind of like um, more of a sharper, like tart orange flavor. Really nice. Pretty creamy on the mouthfeel. That tartness really um, runs well with the creaminess. It kind of helps push it back. It's a subtle beer. It's not super... Um, I, there's, uh, it's not really boozy or anything. I don't get any booziness or anything like that. Malty came out when I clap, when I put my tongue and my palate together. Get a little bready. White bread. Once you get over the tart though, there's a little sweet in the back. Well, it's kind of tart in the back actually. It's kind of sweet in the middle of the tongue, and then it goes back to this like tart, dry, bitter finish kind of thing. Not super bitter, just more tart. Has a little bit of a, a bitter uh, kick in the back though. Finish is um, ah, it's it's a medium to longer finish. For what it is though, it's 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 pretty delicious. I um, would I buy it again? I I mean I I don't know if I'd buy a four pack just because I mean it's it's all right you know it's not bad. I I I would get it again probably in a single or something. But. I don't know. It's not bad though. <laughs> just just throwing that out there. It's not bad. It's actually pretty good and it's worth a try. Out of five hops, I'll give this a four. I will give this a four. Four out of five hops. Right on, man. Right on, everyone. Cheers. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please leave a comment. Let me know what you think. It is quite a interesting one. It was very enticing. I saw it and oh, I had to get it. So um, I do like cranberry sauce and stuff at Thanksgiving. So um, yeah. If you had this before, let me know. If there is a beer that you would like me to try 
or a malted beverage that you would like me to try, let me know in the comment below and I will look it up and see if I can find it in my area. And hopefully I do and I can get you shouted out on my channel. Thank you so much. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and turn that red button gray. And please hit the bell. You'll be notified automatically when I have new shows up. And on your way out, please don't forget to smash that like button. And definitely share this out if you can, if you will, if you may. Cheers. Have a good night. Day, wherever you're from in this world. I'm out of here. Mm, it is refreshing. It is pretty good. <laughs>